Hello my friends and welcome to Mystic Star Magic. Today we're going to have a lot of fun as we have yes or no answers as well as some suggestions and advices on how to actually get the answers that you want. So we're using V-Love and Crystal's de um, decks. We're using um, The Witch Becomes Her. We're using Crystal Says and we're also using her new one which is angel heart messages so very excited i love using all her oracle decks and these guys i just think they're going to be really fun to play with and this is supposed to be kind of like a little short reading so it's not shouldn't take you too long to go through all right and for all of you who haven't watched i do have a video with a collaboration with a whole bunch of amazing readers um please check it out i hope to remember to actually put it up and you know you can see it and click on it and it's all about your next lover and what kind of a relationship you're going to have with them so and it was very insightful i really enjoyed it and watching everybody else's reading was always like wow it was amazing um what <laughs> i always forget what i want to tell everybody first of all just thank you so much for being here <laughs> oh my god <laughs> yes i love uh, you know sharing your energy sharing you know time with you sharing our journey together i 100 i'm excited to be doing that with you all of you <laughs> of course it's just amazing <laughs> all right enough jibber jabber let's go ahead and take a deep breath in close our eyes clear our mind for a second and now i want you to think about the question that you have all right now like as we exhale and open our eyes choose whichever pile draws you to it all right let's do this hello group one i am so happy that you are here let's actually see what kind of awesome like well is it a yes or no let's actually get to it right <laughs> just this beautiful bunny and i'm hoping that that gives us some more insight as we go through so right now we have brooklyn says proceed cautiously so that's a, a maybe kind of um and we also have the emperor okay so this for me is a yes um but i feel like it needs to like you need proceed with caution but it's also about taking action um and not just random action but inspired action the bunny here is letting me know um let's see the bunny has several meanings it has um fear sometimes can stop us from doing something um and so that that there's a meaning there but also the bunny is actually able to um it's a, an abundance signal as well so i feel like you have the power to 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 go on to to get the answer that you want um but the most likely to me it's a yes um <clears throat> But there's something you need to do. There's like you need to bridge something. There's something like I feel like there's a fear blocking you. Um, but you the answer is yes, but there's like more to it. So let's see what, what the more to it is. So we have this is our advice for it. So we have the thrifty witch. So creative, prudent, and economical. So we have like um so yeah, maybe, maybe being thrifty, maybe saving. Um I do see the creativity here. Um I almost feel like, but again, like I said, it's creative action, not necessarily um, just taking action for the sake of action, but actually letting it and be inspired. But here is really a saying about being thrifty, economical, conserving what you need to conserve to make this a yes. And see, it feels like still you need to take action with it. So, and being prudent. So again, not going crazy, proceed with caution here again. That's prudent, being prudent is, is that as well. Um, let's see what other advice we have. We have potential. Your angels are helping you see your true potential. Your work has begun. You are here to make a difference. Look at this. So there is potential and to, to get this, to, to get that, yes. <clears throat> but you have to, like there is work to be done with it. Um, I really feel like this might be like your your fear might be blocking you in a little bit of, of that's why it is. But let's also see what uh, we have like I forget what these are called, the yes or no answer somehow. <laughs> Indeed. So yeah, it's it's saying yes. And let's do the giant um rolling of the die. 
you need to go all out. Okay, so that is your answer, group one. I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, please consider liking, commenting, and subscribing. Um, I do do this. Um, I do little readings every so often, and do check me out on other social media. I am on Instagram, you, uh, TikTok, and Pinterest. I try to be there more often, so. <laughs> Yay. Thank you, thank you, thank you for being here. Thank you for sharing your beautiful energy with me, your beautiful time with me, and of course your journey. I'm sending you a big old hug and lots and lots of blessings. <clears throat> Until I see you in the next one, bye-bye, group one. Hello, group two. Oh, I'm so happy you are here. So you chose this beautiful bird and we're gonna use it as in a reading. So like right off the bat, let's see, yes or no? We have take action <laughs> this is funny because group one also had to take action <clears throat> but that seems like yes you can seems to me like a yes okay yeah and then with the three of cups here it's a definite yes um we're gonna leave this for a little bit um again look at that <laughs> that was okay that was a, a slight mishap but that is okay it sort of feels like so we need to take action. So I feel like, so you don't stumble. Okay, that makes sense. All right, so here we go. You need to take charge of whatever it is. This is actually you taking charge. And so it's a little different of than group ones because you actually need to take charge. You need to actually um, not just take action, but need to take charge. You have to decide. There is, um, I feel like, support there for you if you need it. Um, I feel like almost reaching out maybe to friends or to people who will help you along with this. It's like you, you're building it up. There's a sense here of peace or maybe an offering coming for you as well. So maybe offering, maybe it's a, <clears throat> maybe offering something to somebody and then getting something back. I don't know. It's like a, it feels like there's reciprocal <laughs> card here. Let's look at more other things. But so far it's a yes to me that's a definite like it's a yes um <clears throat> but you know you have you might have to be the one who initiates let's see what other wisdom we have so create your witch nurture empathy and cause yeah see how this is like it's really all about um coexistence there's a sense of needing to um work with somebody or it yeah to me it just seems like that that is um like this will be a yes with help. I don't know why I feel like that. Nurture. Because it, it's the three of cups. There's like a, a friendship. There's a sense of community there as well. So yeah. Yes with with others coming through. I hope that makes a lot of sense. And we also have this. So intention. This is also guidance here. So you are being encouraged to shine your light. Put your full attention to everything you do and every, and every life you touch. Um, again, this is like you taking the, the, the driver's wheel. That's intention here, right there. You have, to, in order to get that answer, which is to me a yes, um, you need to actually take, you know, full charge of your, whatever it is. <laughs> need to take full charge. Let's see what the, and possibly maybe offering. I don't know why I feel like this might be like an offering of peace offering or something, something like there's some sort of thing where you connect. Um, so yeah, <laughs> let's see what, what I have the little thing. So you say yes or no card, yes or no answer to the collective of group two's question. And okay, it says uncertain, but I, it's uncertain. Okay, I think it's a, a yes, but you do have, there's, there's a, a little, you know, like the little, what do you call those? When they say, when they always say, oh, it, in the drug commercials where they're like blah, blah 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 and then there's like the fine print there you go a fine print there um let's see what the big dice tells us yes or no to the collective of group two's question oh this is a thumbs up okay so it seems like yes you have it you got it it's a thumbs up okay I hope you like this little fun yes or no question and if you did please consider liking commenting then commenting and subscribing i can't talk i promise um i'm just i'm beyond grateful that you're here sharing your beautiful time sharing your beautiful energy and of course sharing your journey with me i truly appreciate you and i'm sending you so many blessings and a big old hug until i see you in the next one bye bye group two Hello group 
group three, I I'm so happy that you are here. Okay, so this is letting us know that some sort of message is coming through here. Let's see what the answer is, yes or no. We have not possible at the time, right now. I'm not saying forever, so this is a no so far. Um, might be, I raised it, I know, but look at this. Okay, so I'm saying there's a not possible, like there's a no, but there is a chance for, I want to say something better because this is the ace of pentacles so something is being offered okay <clears throat> so no right now because something else and this is the call that you're getting this is like a, a call that means something better is coming some a new offer is coming here on in your way that's actually i love this and sometimes i like i feel like this is um for business or something like that <clears throat> or for like it could be for many different things but yeah because whatever choice you whatever it's like you wanted it was it's not good for you right now it's like it's blocked for your own safety but something better is coming so i do like that <clears throat> let's see what other advice we have thelma witch free will true path alignment yeah so what i'm seeing here is that <laughs> so interesting <clears throat> there is always free will you can always choose whatever because i feel like there this is an offering but this is more aligned to your path whatever this offering is whatever this is being like your the call that you're receiving the offer that you're getting it is more aligned with your with with your path your truth self um versus wherever this was it was not it was blocked for a reason see what other things are coming through here <clears throat> crossroads your angels are urging you to make important changes consider the options before you so yeah so again, yeah, like I said, there is a sense of very strong free will. So I feel like you can make this answer whatever you want it to be. But I feel like the universe and like your guides are telling you that there is a better option. There is a better offer coming your way. Um, but you need to, of course, we always like need to make that choice. It's free will, but this one aligns more with your path versus this one. If you're feeling <clears throat> so, so what this reminds me of is sometimes I push, I keep pushing and pushing and pushing and pushing towards getting something like, um, <laughs> I, there were many times when I wanted a certain, let's say, job, and I, like, I went through a whole, like, and it just kept on being blocked. It was like, I went through a whole bunch of different, like, um, jumped through different hoops, and every time I was doing anything, it would just kind of, like, it was really bad. It was just bad. It was like, there was delays and everything, but I kept going because I was like, that's the one I have to do it. And that was the job that I, that I hated <laughs> when I got it. I can't, I can't even paraphrase it like a little better, like not to let myself like gently know. I, I got right after all that struggle and after everything I did, it was like, and I didn't, I didn't understand. Now I'm understanding that sometimes there's obstacles for a reason. <laughs> I, there's sometimes where we have that where we you know we need that like bump on the road to get, help us grow but there's sometimes when there's just something that you really want and there's just like blocks after blocks after blocks after blocks after blocks and 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 you're like wow why is that and then and and like in hindsight it's like because it wasn't a lot you weren't aligned with it it was it was not aligning with your path it wasn't it was it was the job you would hate right you fought for it so hard I fought it for it so hard or like it could even be the relationship the relationship you're like this is gonna be the one and it's just like it keeps stumbling and stumbling and that was what did happen with my relationship like in love life too I just like there was a particular thing I just kept you know like hitting my head against the wall at over and over and over but I kept going because I, I have a stubborn streak in me and I'm like no this is it and then it was like it was the worst thing ever like I, it wasn't good but then once i stopped there the the offer that was actually being there the easy like i would say like the easier path or like the path that was kind of open to me that i could have just been taken that was the one so i feel like that's important for you i don't know why but that's you know and then you you know need to know more about me i guess <laughs> yeah so here is the unknown so we do have an unknown um, because I feel like the world is telling you, you can do it. You can choose. Um, there's no way. <laughs> okay. It's saying no way here. But I, it, yeah. It's saying not possible. No way. Don't do it. Yeah. Okay. Something better is coming. All right. <laughs> All right. Uh, I'm sorry. I just went through a whole thing. But uh, sometimes I feel like I share too much. But then I'm like, we're friends. So come on. <laughs> 
friendship. You should tell me your story. When when was this that actually happened to you? Or you kept persisting, persisting, persisting. And did it happen to you as well that you're like, later on, it was like, that was not what it was supposed to be. All right, <laughs> with that. That if you like this reading, please consider liking, commenting, and subscribing. I am so happy that you are here with me, sharing your beautiful time, sharing your beautiful energy, and of course, sharing your journey with me. I am sending so many beautiful blessings, and of course, a giant hug. And until I see you in the next one, bye bye, group three. group four let's see what you have here for your cards all right here we go we have the sunglasses i'm gonna that's gonna mean something to us i actually feel like there's something hidden from you or you're hiding something from others let's find out <laughs> so what do we have in the works something is in the works for you <clears throat> so the answer is a maybe yes i would say yes a yes um but it's not fully ready to materialize for you it's like what other stuff is coming yeah look at that oh. <laughs> okay so yeah clarity okay so something is to me does it feels like it's in the works something is still hidden from you because you're gonna get this ace of swords um which means to me a clarity like insight coming through and then we have the eight of wait no the seven of cups i don't know why i keep thinking this is the eight of cups but it does i feel to me well, for some of this it's like you would need to possibly walk away from something but um which makes sense with the seven of cups so right now there might be too many choices right there i don't know i feel like there's a lot of choices for you even in in this so something is hidden and needs to come to light once you see this clarity once you have that ace of swords um yeah you're going to be able to make that choice. So it's going to be, to me, it seems like a yes to me. That's that's what I see. But there's something that needs to come to light before that happens. We also have this root culture majestic. So fairy witch. Hmm. So what I would say here is, I almost feel like doing maybe a little research. I don't know why I'm feeling like this is the research about your, 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 like, interesting yeah like I, I feel like there's oh and for some of you just this came if, if you're asking about pregnancy that's definitely i feel like that's a yes because this feels like somebody knitting um baby stuff oh yay congratulations but you might not know yet and it's still like a little hidden um so to me it's also like um with the fairy witch here with the roots culture it feels like that it, it's needing to go back yeah it, it feels like there's something in the past that's some insight coming from the past that that gives us something so look into your like think about this question and, and then like think about pa the past maybe also like your like your roots family ancestors but uh, um for me it's like something stemming from the past let's see what other stuff some oh, symbiosis oh that's an interesting here so your angels are helping you improve your close relationship with trust, communication, honesty, and healthy boundaries. Um, so con connections. Okay, that's also true here because we do have, uh, to me, those are mushrooms. <laughs> so there is a sense of connecting. Okay, so I would say, I would say yes. To me, this is definitely a yes, because it says it's in the works. Yes, it's just not right away. And there's something that needs to come. There's a clarity that you need to achieve. Um, and I feel like it, it does stem maybe with your ancestors or roots or maybe connecting to somebody else coming through here. The, the sunflowers, like connecting to others. That will give you a help, a help you have a sense of clarity coming through. Let's see what, okay. Affirmative, yeah, look at that. It says affirmative, yes, yes, yes. That's a yes, and now we're gonna do the giant dice. Oof. Okay, it says go all out. Yep, go all out. So you got it. Yay! Okay, so hopefully that makes sense. <laughs> Thank you so much for being here. If you like this reading, please consider liking, commenting, and subscribing. And I'm sending you a giant, giant hug and lots and lots of appreciation for you spending your beautiful time, energy, and journey with me here um until i see you in the next one beautiful beautiful magical blessings a giant hug and bye bye
Hello, group. Well, are we? Yeah, we're doing five. <laughs> I'm like, it's seven. I'm like, I got confused. But seven, that is an important number that's coming through here for you. Um, seven is always about the right path. Um, so make a plan. It's telling us here. So this is your answer. So this to me is, oh, uh, no. <laughs> With the five of pentacles energy is a no energy here but i do feel like it can be a yes or like it can be the answer that you seek but there's a need for alignment here because i feel like yeah that's this is like a making a plan you have to build something before you can actually get that answer um that you're seeking but i do feel like it is you are on your path it's not like it's a, a bad thing this answer that's a no it's a I'd say no now. Yeah, I would say a no right now. Your thoughts, because with the five of um, pentacles, it's always like, I feel like you're not quite ready. It's like you don't see the whole picture and you also don't see the abundance. It's like you're not mentally prepared for it. And maybe financially as well, but I feel like mentally prepared. So it is telling us here how to, you know, make a plan. Oh, I do like that star set. But you are on your path. That's an important thing. Let's see what other stuff. Blood, blood witch, um, lineage power. Yeah, you have a lot more power than you, than you, I think, that you know. I feel like that's also a sense of, like, abundance coming through here. Like, you don't know how abundant you are. Um, but maybe making a plan will help you. And if you plan here with the path, it makes sense. Power bonds. Yeah, it feels like there's a lot more power to you than you are even acknowledging so so i feel like you can make this into the answer that you want but right now as you stand it's not so much it's a no okay let's see what others comfort okay ascend the ascended masters are supporting and assisting you proceed with confidence dignity and affirmation okay look at this so making a plan we actually have look they are supporting and assisting you and the seven of uh, see i keep seeing the seven seven is important five of pentacles is all about feeling like you don't have enough support that you are not strong that you are you feel almost abandoned out in the cold but you don't that's not true i feel like right now the answer is no because or whatever it is is you're sort of blocking yourself so you need to see that you are more powerful you are being supported and you need to make a plan because you are on the right path oh that's strong okay let's see what other a negative, yeah, negative. No, let's see what the big dice says, though. Yeah, it's giving us, like, it's a, a no here, but it's saying, think it over. Okay, so that's an important, but it's a no. <laughs> it's a thumbs down. <laughs> but think it over is important coming through. Okay. <laughs> I know, I'm like, I, I don't like being the one, but I do want you to see that there is positive here. So <laughs> even though it's a negative, so no, um, there is potential. So that is always, that makes me happy. I hope you liked this reading. If you did, please consider liking, commenting, and subscribing. I appreciate that you are sharing your beautiful time, beautiful energy, and your beautiful journey with me. I am sending you many, many magical blessings and a big hug. And until I see you in the next one, bye-bye. Hello, <laughs> group six. Oh boy, uh, as you see that, it is. Okay, you have the magic eight ball, which is interesting to me. Um, we're going to go with it. Let's see if it's a yes or no, though. Right here, we have follow the light, and we have five of swords. Okay, so this is interesting here. It's to me, oh, like here with the five of swords. Okay, five of swords means that you will have a victory, but it is could be a hollow victory. It usually kind of is. Um, and with the following the light, you know, I usually I love the idea of lighthouse, and I still do. But the lighthouse is warning us that there is, what, why lighthouse exists is because there's rocks, and it warns the, the ships that they can crash into the rock so it's important to know i feel like this is a warning yes you can have it so yes there um yeah you can have it like that there is a yes here but it may not be a beneficial yet yes so just be careful that is actually i feel like that's following the light be cautious of all your surroundings don't try to um 
Like, here, always think of this, like, would you rather be right or happy? And, like, be happy. Let gu happiness guide you. Or that's the other stuff. So, baby wish, which, beginnings, curiosity, excitement. Yeah, that's a beautiful thing because that is what we want. That is the light there, right? We want this, um... Beginning, curiosity, excitement. Don't like be so stressed out about trying to win, I feel like is what it is, but rather have fun with it and be excited about all this. Um, that's an important because I see the sun there for us. It's also guiding us. So enlightenment. Your angels are letting you know of a strong connection to spiritual enlightenment. The loss of karma is a work behind the scenes. So <clears throat> this is important, right? Following the light. Following, uh, oh wow. <laughs> I got this following the light so what is it and, and here is the the light the light within you is guiding you here so it's it's saying yes you can have this but maybe it's not for your benefit the eight the magic eight ball I just I feel like you have a, you do have a lot of um, power coming through here but I, I it also feels like <laughs> I'm gonna use this as an actual pool example when you get this is actually, if you get the eight ball at the end of the game, that's when you win. But if you get it before, you you lose the game. So so I feel like that's a warning here too. Ooh, so many like interesting things here. Because it means that don't try to rush it. Don't try to get that yes. Follow the light. Follow your own light. Follow your own like excitement, curiosity, beginnings. Follow that baby witch. Like be curious, be happy. Like, like the happiness is the key. Don't try to win. Um... For the sake of winning if i hope that makes sense oh wow this is actually a very i, I love this <laughs> and it's actually saying like it's an absolutely it's saying like an absolutely no but it's also an absolutely yes it could be so i really i feel like you have the power to make whatever it is that you like you get to make that answer for yourself but even if like it's a uh, if you if you continue on why are you wanting this if it's if it's aligning to to your like your natural um light you know if it's something like that if you're looking at it with happiness excitement curiosity then it will work out for you but if you're doing it for the ego it's a it's a it's it's not it's not going to be good for you it's that's what i'm hearing here okay so this is about is it about your ego or is it about your higher self and and then that's going to be what the answer is yeah okay so it's a yes um and possibly a no is like a yes and a no possibly but it's up to you <laughs> It's like, but it's important, like letting you know there's a thing. Is it about your ego or is it about your higher self? Important. Okay, I hope that makes sense. I hope you like this reading. And if you did, please do consider liking, commenting, and subscribing. I am so, so happy that you are here. Oh, you have no idea. Thank you so much for sharing your time, sharing your energy, and sharing your journey with me. I, oh, I'm so happy you do. <laughs> so happy I get to share mine with you as well. So I'm sending you lots of beautiful, magical blessings. And of course, a giant hug. <laughs> Until I see you in the next one. Bye-bye.